This video shows how to create and configure photo point spreadsheets in Trimble Business Center 2.7. The photo point spreadsheet provides a real-time look at photogrammetry points and photogrammetry observations in the Trimble Business Center project. To get started, create the photo point spreadsheet by going to the View menu and choosing New Photo Point Spreadsheet. I like to click and drag the photo point spreadsheet to the bottom part of the screen and reduce its size so it doesn't clutter my plan and station views. On the left half of the photo point spreadsheet are the photogrammetry points in the project. Critical information is displayed, such as if the point has been resolved successfully, if it's been resolved but with errors, in which case it's flagged, or whether it's unresolved. Here, point 1000 was resolved successfully. Selecting that point will display the three observations that create it. Point 1001 was resolved, but with an error. It's flagged. If I right click, I can create a point derivation report and find the source of the flag. Here, you'll see that the strength of figure value is red, indicating that it is out of tolerance and the geometry of the intersection is poor. This can be easily seen by looking in the plan view at the sharp angle made by the observations to point 1001 from stations Misery and Windy. To resolve the flag, we could add a third observation from station Cold. To do this, I go to the Survey menu, Photogrammetry, Measure Photo Point. When I select point 1001 in the spreadsheet, my station view from station cold automatically turns to it. All I have to do is zoom in and aim my virtual telescope at the top of the pole and press the enter key to create the third observation. TBC automatically recalculates point 1001. It is now reported as resolved with the strength of figure value intolerance. Point 1002 is unresolved. This is because it only has one photogrammetry observation. A minimum of two intersecting photogrammetry observations are required to calculate a point. Here we'll add another observation from station Misery to calculate point 1002. I'll switch my station view from station Cold to Misery. And then I'll use the distance slider bar to move along the line of sight ray from station cold until I locate the pole I'd like to measure. Zooming in and placing the cursor in the object location field will allow me to use the virtual telescope to measure the top of the pole. When I press the enter key, Trimble Business Center automatically calculates point 1002 and note that it is now reported as resolved with the strength of figure value intolerance. To configure the fields displayed in the photo point spreadsheet, go to Project, Project Settings, View, Photo Point Spreadsheet. Here you can customize the fields that are displayed in the spreadsheet. For instance, we may want to show the target height. This would allow us to use target heights with optical targets to measure points on the ground photogrammetrically. Now, the editable target height field is displayed in the photo point spreadsheet. That concludes this video on how to create and configure photo point spreadsheets in Trimble Business Center 2.7.